Hey folks, Captain Dave in the Wolf Den, and I'm looking at the email, onlineoutboards.com. Your order is out for delivery. I'm sitting here patiently ready to do phase three, the unboxing. The receipt of the new Mercury 15 horsepower EFI outboard motor kicker. And I got a few extra little things on the board here. It's been delivered by FedEx. I got my tiller. The bracket comes tomorrow. How am I going to run? Let me get out of the shadow here. This is a bad place for this whiteboard because of the shadow. 12 volt. I think I'm going to run it off the terminals inside the boat transom. The fuel, I think I'm going to run it off the other outlet off my fuel filter. And I'm going to need a couple other little fittings and I'll show you what I'm thinking about doing. But this is all total speculation. Before the motor even gets here, I'm already off in Hitherland. So can you smell what the Jetty Wolf will be unboxing? Well, here's where it's going to end up being. As soon as I have the bracket, I'm going to be mounting the bracket here. i got to get rid of my ladder. I can stand on this all day long. It doesn't go anywhere. That's where Pacific does it. But... Of course, their brackets come out and have big legs coming down. Everything's really based on the bracket. Well, I haven't even run the Suzuki since I got it back from the O2 uh, from the shop, getting the O2 sensor changed. Haven't had time. I had to uh, do my volunteerism at the El Cheapo Sheepshead tour Tournament 2019 as fish cutter extraordinaire. What I'm waiting for right now is a big giant FedEx truck to show up. what we got here. We got the A. You're welcome to use this one if it worked better. You got uh, it? Okay, yeah. Good. Had a little uh, one. Oh, you got bigger tires. It's a fat <coughs> tire one. That's why I didn't want you to get bogged down. But it looks like you got it already. Yeah, I think I got okay. it. Okay. All right. Appreciate that. Thanks.
long. Mm-hmm. Ah, okay. The gas tank here. Yeah. Free gas tank. No, you're paying for it. Just like free delivery? No, you're paying for it. <laughs> it's not free. Nothing's free. I love that. Free delivery. You know, if you just had a rope sling you could put on it, you could pick it up right out of the box with that. Alrighty, folks, guess what? If you don't have some serious stuff like this engine hoist, and you're doing this by yourself, you're going to be taking that box to your nearest dealer. Because let me tell you, this is one unwieldy thing to deal with. 130 pounds of unwieldiness, but here it is. Look at this. Look at, I mean, we got box, cardboard, stuff spread all over. But here it is. I was under the, see, you can't see, everything's a 9.9, 9.9, 9, .9 everything, okay, and I actually thought that I was getting the one with the shifting here instead of here, because then I could shift all with my tiller extension which will go on let me get my tiller extension all right i hope you can see this is my dark garage so the start stop button right here so you got to put this on like this yeah, that might be a good idea. I'm dropping everything. Okay. Go back there. Okay. So, it's got a sleeve in here that you can take out for thicker. Let's see. So, I don't even know if this is going to go on here very good. just enough to stick your finger in here okay. this is all the details folks this is the details that you cannot find any of this on all of YouTube or any search engine is there you go you got to be able to turn it off by pushing that red button and this this thing gives you this handle to do so that again sorry for the jostling around this is really a homemade video let me tell you and you would tighten this up so now you got your throttle and you have this knuckle to be up in the boat to do it so boy is this going to take a lot of playing around it's got a tension controls it's got a lot of stuff a lot of stuff going on and you know what right at the height of spring break here no time to fool around with it absolutely none I get maybe a day here I got people looking at charters who the hell knows and I'm, of course I'm not gonna be messing with this with those with them people on the boat All right, here we go there's the oil filter fuel filter all electronic ignition back here Emissions control. Gotta love that. Boy, do I know all about emissions control, huh? How do you turn this light on? Alright. So, there we go. That's enough, probably, video for today. That is the complete third phase of getting it out of the box. 
Was that was that big time or what? Trying to get it out of the box. Oh man. See trim and tilt control down here. It's got its own trim or tilt. It's not I don't think it trims anything really. So um oil drain. Alright, let's see what the uh let's take a look at the um the other box with the tank and the fuel line in it. 